Welcome to my next video. Today I have in the smart Wi-Fi doorbell camera, IOWIT. I'll go through uh, the basic points of it and do the unboxing. What do we got? Some of the features we got um, AI detection, night vision, two-way audio, easy installation, uh, long battery life. You got to fully charge the battery before you use it, before you use the, the camera itself. Notification to your smartphone wide angle lens weather resistant and cloud storage a purchase through the app there's a qr code to download the app we'll do that once we open up the box and yeah group sharing you can share with several people maybe the family it's got the ir night vision and ai human detection that's good because you don't want it going off at any little thing that causes movement. I think I already mentioned the two-way audio. You can talk to people. They can talk back to you. Just like in... Okay, we got sponge. First thing we have is the the uh, instruction guide. Once again, the QR code, there's a doorbell chime. You can plug into any USB port in your house, or you can even use this at an RV and plug it in on a USB port. If you want the chime inside, it's got the complete instructions, all, all the breakdown of the video camera itself, quick start guide, QR code again, iWIT. Get it on your Google Play Store or uh, Apple, wherever you get your apps. And very straightforward instructions on how to hook it up. And I'll run to it also. So that's good to keep handy. Uh, in this box here, we have a... Oh, this pin. I'll show you what that's for right away. You got the charging cable. So you can fully charge it before you mount it. And also screws and plugs if you're going to screw it right in to your wall or your mounting surface. The chime. It's a USB port, plug her in, and your pairing button. And the camera itself. Good weight, sturdy, and for the pin, right in the top, security, so no one can just pop your camera off. You gotta you have a special pin to push in the top, and then it opens it up. Safety tab for the battery, you gotta remove that, just so you can charge it, Power and on. power's on. Right away, it starts trying to pair. Entering pairing mode. So we'll get the app downloaded and carry on from there. And here's the charging port. If you're going to charge, very straightforward. Reset button. Entering pairing mode. Okay, for the uh, app, first thing you got to do is scan the QR code. And the website comes up for the app. And unlock my phone, of course. And it takes her to AOIT app. And I'm going to Google Play because I got an Android phone. You have to go differently if you got Apple. Hit install. And install it. Open. And I'm not registered for this app yet, so you obviously you got to sign up. Agree. And we'll go through the sign up process and then we'll get back. Okay, once you sign up, it's going to send you an email, which you got to confirm so you can log in. 
Then you'll get a congratulations. And you can go back to the app. Okay, open the app. Log in. Then you'll just click on add device. You got to select which one you have. If you're not sure which one you have, just look on the back of the box, but this one's a T50. Okay, press the doorbell button. Hours and on, and we got a flashing red light. Next, searching Bluetooth device. Entering this, pairing mode. This is where you just name your device. I'm going to just leave it at front door. It's going to pick up your Wi Fi, which is good for me. Then you got to enter your Wi Fi password. Entering pairing mode. Okay, Wi-Fi passwords entered. Just hit the next. Entering pairing mode. Just confirming the network. To obtain distribution network information and wait for Wi-Fi connection. Connecting to network. Counting down. Wi-Fi connection successful. Waiting for device registration. It just talks right to you. Sign up successful. Registration successful. Confirm. And away we go. And you can see I got it sideways, but it is working. So we'll go to the next step and get it mounted. Okay, camera's connected. Okay, camera's connected. You can hear the audio okay, going. You can hear the audio going. Okay, depending on the setup at your place, you could have it straight on from the door. I'm gonna put mine on a little bit of an angle, just get a wider view of what's going on. Plus, I don't want it going off on every little, or everything that just drives by. On the motion sensor so once the base is screwed in place you just snap her in and that's it it's mounted now when you need to take it off for charging just use the tool provided put her in the top little hole there pops right off so you can charge it and snap her back in place once you get it charged. You can hear a little click. Make sure you hear a click because you don't want it falling on the on the floor or on the pavement or anything. And that's that. Now we'll look at the app again, see what you see. Okay, when someone presses the doorbell. You get a notice on your app. And also, I got the uh, chime installed in the house. So we got the notice, we answer, obviously. And there's the live view. You can have sound. Let's go back outside. And... You see what you see. Now, if you're wondering why I don't got a shirt, it's like uh, 40, de 40 degrees C here. I'll shut off the audio so it's not double playing back. But yeah, there you go. It comes up and presses it, pops up on your phone, and you can view. Up in the top right corner, it's got your power. Right now I'm at 94%. Uh, you can change the view sideways is a better picture 
and you can take a screenshot screenshot taken so you can save it download it or put it in your storage if you want to talk to someone this might uh, reverberate quite a bit let's well, let's try it who are you who are you Get away from my house. It works good. Okay, well that's the camera, the doorbell camera, Wi-Fi. Um, it's got a good picture. So if you think you might be interested in such a camera, I'll have a link in the description. If you've got any questions, please ask. Please like and follow. It really helps me out a lot. And we'll see you on the next video.